वेलकम टू सिंपली लॉजिकल दिस इज वेंकटेश देर वॉज ए मैजिकल पॉन्ड बिटवीन थ्री टेम्पल्स इफ एनी बडी वुड वॉश द फ्लावर्स इन द पॉन्ड द फ्लावर्स डबल्ड सो वंस ए पर्सन वेंट टू ए गार्डन प्लक्ट सम फ्लावर्स एंड वॉश इट इन द मैजिकल पॉन्ड एंड केप्ट सम फ्लावर्स इन वन टेम्पल आफ्टर दैट ई वेंट टू द पॉन्ड एंड वॉश द रिमेनिंग नंबर ऑफ फ्लावर्स एंड केप्ट द एग्जैक्ट नंबर ऑफ फ्लावर्स दट ई केप्ट इन द फर्स्ट टेम्पल in the second temple he again washed the remaining number of flowers and again kept the same number of flowers he kept in the first and second temple in the third temple and he was at last left with zero flowers so what are the number of flowers he plucked from the garden and what are the number of flowers he kept in every temple this is a popular interview puzzle asked in several job interviews feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution let me explain the solution now according to the puzzle there are three temples and one magical pond if anybody would wash the flowers in that pond the flowers doubled in all the temples there are exact number of flowers kept we are supposed to find total number of flowers plucked from the garden and what are the number of flowers kept in every temple suppose a person start the trip with x flowers and he leave y flowers at each temple here are the number of flowers person have at after each stage of the trip so at the start let the number of flowers he plucked be x now in pond he washed x number of flowers this will result in 2x because if anybody would wash the flowers in that pond the flowers doubled Now let the number of flowers he kept in each temple be y. Hence, at temple one, y number of flowers are kept. After this, number of flowers left will be two x minus y. Now again in pond, he washed two x minus y number of flowers. This will result in two times two x minus y, which is equal to four x minus two y. This is because we already know if anybody would wash the flowers in that pond, the flowers doubled. So now at temple two, y number of flowers are kept again. After this, number of flowers left will be four x minus two y minus y, which is equal to four x minus three y. Again in pond, he washed four x minus three y number of flowers. This will result in two times of four x minus three y, which is equal to eight x minus six y. because we already know that if anybody would wash the flowers in that pond the flowers doubled finally at temple 3 y number of flowers are kept after this number of flowers left will be 8x minus 6y minus y which is equal to 8x minus 7y as per the puzzle after placing flowers at the third temple person have no flowers this means the final equation is equal to 0 here the final equation is 8x minus 7y hence 8x minus 7y equals 0 after simplifying x equals 7 over 8 times y we want to find whole number solution to this equation as the fraction 7 over 8 cannot be reduced any further the variable y needs to be a multiple of 8 to eliminate the denominator the smallest value for y is 8 which means the smallest value for x is 7 so the answer is person started with seven flowers and he left eight flowers at each temple so let's validate the solution now at start let the number of flowers he plucked is 7 in pond he washed seven flowers this will result in 14 because if anybody would wash the flowers in the pond the flowers doubled now the number of flowers he kept in each temple is 8 hence at temple 1 8 flowers are kept after this number of flowers left will be 14 minus 8 which is equal to 6 now again in pond he washed six flowers that will result in 12 because we already know if anybody would wash the flowers in that pond the flowers doubled 
Also, we know that the number of flowers he kept in each temple is eight. Hence, at temple two, eight flowers are kept. After this, number of flowers left will be twelve minus eight, which is equal to four. Now, again in pond, he washed four flowers. This will result in eight because the number of flowers doubled. Finally, in temple three, eight flowers are kept because that is the number of flowers he kept in each temple. After this, number of flowers left will be eight minus eight, which is equal to zero, and this is what it is expected. The solution to this puzzle is the person plucked seven flowers from the garden and eight he kept in every temple. So by following these simple steps, we can find the solution in less time and accurately. That's all for this video. Let me know if you have any questions. I will try to address as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting puzzle. Thank you.